Hello friends and my dear students. Welcome to your own channel Biplops Gurukul. Students, in this video we are going to discuss the grammar, vocabulary and writing skill of your question paper set 4 NCRT class 7. So students, watch this video till the end so that you can get all the question answers very clearly. And students, if you are new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so that you can get all my new videos in your notification. So students, without wasting any time, let's get started. So students, let me go through the question of grammar and vocabulary. So question number four, the first question in your grammar, which is fill in the blanks with articles and prepositions. Okay. So one into three you will have three blanks where you have to write proper article and preposition okay the kind people fed the pet dash tidbits of fish from their own chopsticks and all the boiled rice it wanted thus treated dash dumb creature loved its protectors like a being with their soul so here the answers will be the kind people fed the pet with tidbit of fish from their own chopsticks and all the boiled rice it wanted. Thus tweeted the dumb creature loved its protectors like a being with a soul. Understood? The first one is with, the second one is the, the third one is a. Uh. Okay, let's come to the next question. Write the correct alternative to fill in the blanks. 1 into 3. So, so one mark for each answer. When Charles Darwin is, was, where, a boy, he will show, shows, showed, no promise to be a good student. He has, is, had great interest in flowers, birds and stories about them in his books. Understood? So you have to choose one among the three options and now I will give you the answer. So when Charles Darwin was a boy, he showed no promise to be a good student. He had great interest in flowers, birds and, story, and stories about them in his books. So I hope you have got all the answers. Okay, so let's come to the next question. Here you can have 7 do as directed. Answer the following questions as directed. Okay, so one mark for each answer. Number 1 A. We dash love our neighbors. So the instruction is use modal. So you have to use a modal auxiliary verb. So the answer will be should. We should love our neighbors. Okay. Now come to the next question. I will give him a pen. Change the voice. So you have to change the voice of the verb. Okay. So you can see the sentence is in future tense. Okay. So the answer is he will be given a pen by me. Okay. He will be given a pen by me. Come to the next question. Question number C. I cannot remember the incident. Change the voice. So the answer will be the incident cannot be remembered by me. Next question. Question number D. My teacher said practice brings perfection. Okay. So you can easily recognize that the reported speech is a universal truth. The reported speech is a universal truth and so as you know that whenever you get a reported speech which is universal truth or habitual truth then you know the tense of the reported speech will be the same let's uh, go through the answer my teacher said that practice brings perfection see the tense of the reported speech remains the same. Okay. 
so practice brings perfection it is written in present tense and uh, and when we change the mode of narration from direct to indirect the tense of the reported speech remains the same practice brings perfection come to the next question question number e i requested the office to consider in bracket my application use a prefix to the given word so you have to write a prefix so what will be the answer i requested the office to reconsider my application prefix re has been added to the root word consider and it has become reconsider okay so come to the next question question number f he had no money he could not buy his textbook use an infinitive to join them into a single sentence okay so the answer will be he had no money to buy his textbook okay so let's come to the next question question number g his father went to delhi his object was to visit rajghat join them into single sentence by using infinitive so the answer is his father went to delhi to visit rajghat okay so that's all from grammar and vocabulary now come to the writing skill so you can see question number 7 write a story on the basis of the following points a dishonest shopkeeper gives underweight when asked he says you have to carry less load a clever customer pays less and says you have to count less okay so 13 marks has been given and as you know that you have to write 100 to 120 words okay so here is an example of this story so the title will be a story of a clever customer you can write anything which is suitable for the story so this is not restricted you can use any word or you can use any title which will be suitable for the story so come to the story this is a story of a little village near dhanbad people in this village were innocent but not so educated there was a big grocery shop in the middle of the village the shopkeeper ravi was very dishonest very often he tries to cheat his innocent customers with his wit every time he gave underweight of what was asked by the customers if anyone asked about it he replied you have to carry less load he carried on such practice for a long unfortunately for ravi one day a clever customer named gopal turned up and ordered a kilo of rice when ravi gave him less amount of rice gopal became surprised but kept his cool and planned to teach him a good lesson he paid him less looking at the money ravi felt at sea and asked gopal the reason he replied ravi that he had to count less finally ravi realized his fault and de decided not to cheat anyone in future i have given a probable answer so now come to the next question question number 8 write a dialogue between two friends who have just come out of the exam hall okay there are some hints discussion about the english paper next topics in the writing section next unknown but easy next point the unseen passage is rather lengthy next point the grammar part somewhat difficult okay so these are the hints for this question and you have to write for 12 marks here is a conversation between two friends amal and bimal who have just come out of the exam hall okay so you can see at the third bracket plot of the conversation has been given at the corridor okay so the conversation was happening at the corridor amol hi bimal how's your paper looking excited bimal looked up somewhere not so good as i expected friend how was yours hope 
you got the right side of the coin by the way what option you chose from the question number 1a omol smiling oh that's easy it will be option number c what did you choose bimal taking a deep breath thank god i did the same i had a doubt but now i'm relieved which paragraph did you write omol obviously the impact of science in our life what about you bimal but i attempted the other one though it's unknown to me but easy to write the unseen passage was rather lengthy wasn't it what do you say omol yes it took me almost 20 minutes to solve i read this passage once in a magazine which my father bought a month ago i hope all the answers are right it has 10 marks and i have to get full marks in it what about the grammar bimal looking at the question paper don't ask it was not what i had wanted before the exam apart from the first two questions all the others seem to me like reaching everest with one leg i had been confident before entering into the hall but as i went through the paper i felt at sea and what about you amol you are right that the grammar part was somewhat difficult but i practiced a lot and i didn't find the questions that much difficult so now the plot has been shifted to a place near the main gate okay bimol so i wish you score better marks then Amol I hope so and I will pray to God that you will also get good marks in this subject but the most important thing is to study hard for the next exam isn't it Bimol you are absolutely correct okay then goodbye see you on monday waving his hand Amol oh sure see you then take care bye waving back so this is the probable answer of the dialogue in my next video i will tell you how to write a dialogue okay i hope you have got all the answers so if you have any questions or queries please comment below and don't forget to subscribe like and share this channel so this is viplav choudhury signing off today see you in the next video till then stay home stay safe tata -ta.